Alternative Dispute Resolution The Rationale for ADR Introduction Disagreements can lead to frustration and distrust in the justice system when they take too long to resolve. Quick settlement of disputes in society is essential as it brings certainty, upholds fairness, and maintains positive relationships among people. Ensuring resources like money and time are wisely used is an additional benefit. In India, resolving legal disputes through traditional courts can be time-consuming, expensive, and emotionally draining for the involved parties. Complex court procedures and prolonged appeal processes contribute to the challenges. Moreover, personal feelings and delay tactics further complicate matters. With a large population, the existing number of courts is insufficient to handle the diverse range of disputes. Alternative Dispute Resolution ADR, methods have gained popularity in India due to these challenges. ADR has been practiced in the country for a long time, based on established principles and processes. Given the current backlog of cases and the strain on the judiciary, there is a pressing need for consent-based ADR methods. These methods offer a faster and more efficient way to resolve disputes without lengthy court battles. Historical Rational ADRAS Embodiment of Time-Tested Wisdom Ancient India's Community-Based Dispute Settlement Long ago, disputes were resolved without courts, as people sought the guidance of respected community members, known as panchayats. Non-compliance resulted in exclusion from community events. Arbitration in Vedic times, even during the Vedic era, disputes were referred to specialized groups or individuals for arbitration, with the possibility of appealing to higher authorities. British colonial rule and changes to panchayat system. During British colonial rule, changes were made to the traditional panchayat system, allowing courts to encourage arbitration. Specific regulations were introduced to handle disputes, especially those of smaller value. Milestones in formal arbitration. In 1889, India enacted its first substantial arbitration law, following the British Arbitration Act. Over time, additional laws facilitated arbitration and recognition of foreign awards. The Arbitration Act of 1940 The Arbitration Act of 1940 allowed both court-involved and non-court-involved arbitration. It offered protection to agreements, empowered courts to address misconduct, and modify or set aside awards when necessary. Modernizing Dispute Resolution for India's Growing Economy As India's economy grew and globalization increased, the need for efficient and business-friendly dispute resolution methods arose. In response, the current Arbitration and Conciliation Act was enacted in 1996 by the Indian Parliament. Introducing Plea Bargaining To address the backlog of criminal cases, plea bargaining was introduced based on the Malimit Committee Report. This allowed for alternative resolutions in specific criminal cases. General Rationale for Alternative Dispute Resolution Cost Effectiveness One significant advantage of ADR is its cost effectiveness compared to traditional court proceedings. By opting for these methods, individuals can avoid expensive legal battles, preserving their savings and financial well-being. Additionally, reduced reliance on courts eases the burden on public finances in resource-limited countries. Less traumatic for parties involved. ADR prioritizes a less traumatic experience for those involved in disputes. Legal battles can be emotionally and mentally draining, but ADR encourages parties to collaborate and find mutually beneficial solutions. This approach fosters a more amicable atmosphere, promoting constructive dialogue and understanding, confidentiality and preserving relationships. Confidentiality is a key aspect of ADR. Unlike court proceedings, ADR methods keep matters private, making them ideal for sensitive business or family disputes. This preserves delicate relationships and allows parties to address issues discreetly. Harmonious resolution for societal benefits. Using ADR contributes to harmonious dispute resolution, benefiting society as a whole. With increased economic activity and societal changes, conflicts are inevitable. ADR helps address these disputes amicably, leading to balanced and fair solutions that positively impact the socio-economic structure in the long term. Conclusion Alternative dispute resolution methods offer multiple advantages, including cost-effectiveness, reduced emotional toll, confidentiality, and harmonious resolutions. 
By utilizing these approaches, individuals and society can achieve efficient and peaceful dispute resolution, promoting a healthier and more productive environment for all parties involved. Rationale behind different styles of mediation and therapeutic jurisprudence. Mediation styles. Explore the different styles of mediation. Evaluative mediation. The mediator provides guidance on the case's worth and settlement options based on experience with similar cases. Facilitative mediation. The mediator helps parties re-evaluate their positions without imposing personal opinions, fostering open communication and self-discovered solutions. Therapeutic and transformative mediation. Therapeutic mediation allows parties to express emotions and understand each other, while transformative mediation aims at changing parties' perspectives, viewing disputes as opportunities for growth. Tailored approaches. Understand the need for mediators to adopt tailored approaches depending on each dispute's uniqueness, considering cultural backgrounds, attitudes, and economic positions of the parties involved. ADR is a therapeutic and preventive approach. Discover how ADR offers a therapeutic and preventive approach to the overburdened litigation system in India. Lawyers and clients can identify psychological concerns, select procedures with positive effects, and establish systems to avoid non-therapeutic legal procedures. Mediation's effectiveness. Learn how mediation effectively addresses broad issues, preventing further disputes by providing a safe space for clients to share their stories and be heard. Arbitration considerations. Understand that while arbitration has its merits, it may have limitations in implementing preventive law techniques. However, parties can still broaden the scope of questions presented to the arbitrator to find innovative solutions. Summary. Discover the power of Alternative Dispute Resolution, ADR, in effectively resolving disputes. Learn how ADR methods strive to achieve settlements and why it's essential to promote its widespread adoption in India. Embracing tradition and modernity, India's cultural heritage encompasses a harmonious blend of modern and ancient practices. By preserving the best of both worlds, we ensure that people in India have access to top-notch dispute resolution methods. Encouraging fair and timely settlements. At every stage of a legal case, promoting settlement through ADR can lead to faster and fairer resolutions, guided by principles of fairness and conscience. See how ADR goes beyond resolving disputes, contributing to societal harmony and welfare, especially in resource-constrained scenarios. Promoting the ADR movement. Speeding up the ADR movement is crucial for efficient conflict resolution. While ADR methods offer numerous advantages, their suitability varies from case to case. Judges play a pivotal role in determining whether mediation or plea bargaining is appropriate based on the nature of the dispute and parties' willingness to settle. Conclusion. Unlock the potential of alternative dispute resolution, ADR in India for smoother and more effective conflict resolution, integrating tradition and modernity, encouraging settlement, and promoting the ADR movement will pave the way for a harmonious society and resource-efficient resolution of disputes keywords, ADR, arbitration, arbitrator, conciliation, conciliator, mediation, mediator, judicial settlement, low kadalat, family court, criminal trial,